Okay, I love, love these pants so much. Like, these have this crisscross look to them, and I'm just like, this is like my vibe, right? Like, just super big, bulky pants. And then this is a bathing suit top. I'm thinking about for Mexico, Tulum, which is like palm trees, summery kind of vibe. Like I'm probably gonna be in a lot of swimsuits, so this is a great swimsuit because it kind of looks like a top without being just like, you know, your typical triangle bikini top. I don't know how people do this. So I kind of like, I was like between these like slender white sandals, um, I decided to go, I feel like these chunky ones are like kind of fun. And then we can bring this bag you know it's kind of bulky you can also bring this little one i just like love how they're like you know this is like the vibe i feel like for 2022 is trouser pants low waisted when i first put these on i thought that well, or even when i was looking at them right because like i normally wear my pants like up here like, all right these are way too big and they're too short like i don't know if you can see i was like okay they're too short and they just like look frumpy but then i was like oh wait we're supposed to be wearing pants low waisted now and then i realized they fall perfectly on my hips and not my waist and the length is perfection and it's just like a little like honestly I was listening to the radio this morning and they were talking about Aaliyah about how she was this like feminine tomboy aesthetic that she pulled off so so well and like really made people feel more comfortable like embracing that tomboy-esque and I feel like I like to go that route a lot of times. I like to be feminine and like wear dresses and stuff sometimes but I also really like the like casual comfortness of like a feminine tomboy vibe and i feel like that's gonna be like a big vibe for 2022 so as you know we're preparing for the two trips the miami and tulum ones you might see some of that frankie's bikinis and lioness here is another example so these pants are also from the lioness haul again i was like oh my god i think they're too big whatever even like buttoning them and putting them on i'm always like wow they're too big but again they're supposed to sit on your hips and they they fit perfectly here so i'll put all the sizing and everything down but the same kind of thing this like tomboy-esque kind of vibe with this top i got this from urban outfitters last summer and i just love it it's like this lingerie style top you know and then it has like the beige kind of brown in the background which pulls this really well and i really want to wear this back so i feel like this is cool and like this gives like the feminineness feminine kind of like pinky color with like the baggy pants and then this one i think would be cute with the slender sandals so like a little bit cuter but you get the vibe and that again like brings it to a close i don't know i feel like this could be cute for so many things honestly i'm so excited for summer i think this could be cute for miami maybe if not then i'll wear this at any other time in the entire summer like it's like a cargo corduroy fabric which this is like the second thing of corduroy that i bought recently i bought a coat that is also a corduroy and it's very strange because i've never bought anything corduroy 
for I don't know like 15 years or something so it's very interesting that this is the second thing that I bought but they're jeans they fit really great I love the color and you're coming home with me all right here's another look honestly I don't know what this could be for because I feel like this isn't Tulumi. I don't know maybe this could be like maybe I'm going too hard honestly in the pants so like maybe it could be like a cute Miami like oh going out to dinner look but like sophisticated you know this is the new top I think it's really cute actually I was very much on the fence for this I think it was mostly because I couldn't put it on I couldn't figure out all the straps and then I just kind of like gave up a couple times but I think I like it. So this is also from Linus. I love anything that's kind of like a croppy top kind of thing like this in the summer just because like it can get so hot. These pants are from Zara. They're also a recent buy. And then I just put like a like a thinner sand, black sandal. Put a little back like this. You know, you can put like a little headband on too. My headband's in the other room. Also, I can't pull off headbands. I've tried many times. Maybe some cute, like, sunnies. Maybe not these. So this is the top. It's a pretty thin material. Um, if the whole shirt was this and, like, covered up, I feel like you could probably sweat through it. Um, I don't have nip covers on. I don't have any here. I ordered some more. They're at my New York apartment. But I like the back. I love open back. For me, I love an open back. And this covers a good amount on the side. I think that is my newest thing is like this has to cover enough here. I love the back. I tucked in a little bit, but like not. I don't know. I love these pants. These are definitely a summer spring pant. All right, so I'll have to think about this one. This one's really, really cute. I honestly am just wondering if I'm doing too much pant look. So maybe I'll try and switch that up for the next look. This is the new lioness top. I think it's really cute. <laughs> I wore this with super low cut, one of my super low cut pants. And my husband was like, whoa, straight out of like a 90s, whatever. Oh, this is the one thing that keeps annoying me. It keeps like pulling to make this like wider and I want it to stay no one likes different length strings no one trusts that anybody with different length strings am I right okay so here's a look I put together this is the lioness shirt it's like a stretchy material it's very comfortable I love anything this material so it's very nice and this like you know, it works well for me because I have no chest. I put it with this black skirt, this like midi black silk skirt. It's beautiful. It is from Rose Waterhouse. And you can just tell it's like really good material, really good quality. So I don't know, I mean, this could be like another like dinner party look, you know? I feel like all of my looks are like sophisticated now with like an element of like, you know, whatever you want to call this. I put my favorite Amina shoes with it. Super comfortable and they give another bit of like flair to the whole vibe. But honestly, I'm gonna have to think about this. This is like extremely irritating to me. Like it just keeps getting wider and wider. I don't know, I have to like reevaluate this whole thing. This is like another cute Miami dinner look, right? I feel like in Miami, we're gonna be like sophisticated ladies. And in Tulum, we have to be like boho, free, chic, like kind of vibes. So I guess that's okay. You know, I'm gonna be going out to dinner with my husband. He's probably gonna be wearing like, I don't know, a suit or something in Miami because he has work meetings. So I feel like this will be like nice. And then I'll probably pair it with the same black bag. Should I get a new one? Guys, how stunning. It's like a linen material and there's a, 
there's something underneath it. So like, it's extremely comfortable. Is that better? So you can see the whole thing? Still not good. All right, so this, I'm obsessed with this dress. I got this early, yeah, I got this sometime early last year and I have not worn it. And I feel like it's because I have not found, I, I tried it on and I love it so much and I really honestly feel like it's because I have not found the best occasion to wear this to. I feel like it's a good like wedding guest dress, but like, is it too much? Like, is this too heavy for Tulum? Like, I just don't know. Or like some other event, like maybe not to their wedding, but like maybe to like anything else. Maybe to like a nice dinner. Maybe to Valentine's Day dinner in Tulum, because I think we're gonna do that. I don't know. It's just so beautiful and I really wanna wear it. And I wanna keep it casual. Like, I don't know, like something like this. Ah, this bag, no. But these shoes are cute with it. You know, it's like a pop of white maybe. I don't know. Then we can do like a Chanel. I mean, the Chanel makes it like more casual. So, I don't know actually, I have to think about the, the bag, I guess. Do I really have nothing? Okay, what do we think? Can we wear this to Tulum? That's the first question. Can we wear this to Tulum? But two, can we wear this to a beach wedding? I'm gonna go ask my husband. Ding, ding, ding. Hi, that sounds so corny. We have a winner. Okay, I'm really, really happy because um, I just asked him and he actually really likes this for a wedding. He's like, oh, it's beachy. And I love it so much. The whole vibe is like literally gonna be on a beach for the wedding. But the bride was telling us like, you know, don't wear shoes. Like there's gonna be a thing where you take off your shoes. So like you're gonna be in the sand, whatever. And I've always wanted to wear this dress with no shoes. I mean, that was before I got those white ones and I was like, these are good with them because it's basically like not really wearing shoes. Now I can wear it without wearing shoes and I am, I'm really excited. Can we get another, another look at the dress? And the back. All right, I'm really happy. Now we have to think about what we're gonna wear to the welcome party and what we're gonna wear to Miami wedding. All right guys, what's the status on this one? It's kind of casual, but also kind of like dressy. Like some beige heels with them. I don't know if you can see down there. Beige, little bag. Oh, I don't know. I don't know how I feel. Uh, I don't really have anything to say here. So this is the obvious Tulum dress. It's like flowy, floral, super cute. It's long sleeve. I'm looking at another one that's very similar, but has no sleeves. So I'm contemplating getting that. I could totally wear this to their like welcome ceremony. You know, it's cute, like whatever. I wear this all the time. That's the other thing. I mean, like it's kind of neutral and classic. So I can wear it all the time. This is like one of my all time favorite dresses for the spring and everything. It's super comfortable. I sized up in this because it is super short. So I wanna be aware of that. But she's dressed like wearing espadrilles. So I feel like I have to wear espadrilles like with something. So these could be cute with it. I'm not really like an espadrille kind of girl, but you know. So I'm gonna think about it if I wanna wear this to their welcome event or throw this over like a bathing suit and like wear it into town and wear it more casual. I'm definitely gonna bring it cause it's just like an easy fits the bill to loom dress. So here's the print. I mean, like I said, I mean, it's stunning and this is one of my favorite dresses. I just don't know if people remember me wearing this dress because I wear it all the time. Although I do feel like I wear it like once, maybe twice a year. So I don't know if that's like every time <laughs> if people remember that, but I just like, I think it's super cute. I love it so much. This was a gift for my birthday from Peter like four years ago. This fabric, guys, obviously completely see-through. So I'm going to be wearing it with a swimsuit underneath. I mean, you can see completely through. I bought this dress 
like like three years ago because this wedding was supposed to be a long time ago i bought it for tulum i have to bring this because i've as you see the tag here i've never worn it because when does one wear something like this and it's perfect for tulum so it's super long which like i love i have these super big platform obviously the steve maddens they're extremely comfortable i love them actually so much i've only worn them once ever or them last year during the summer once because i got them kind of at the end so i think that this will be like a really fun kind of cover up you know when going to the beach like we are tulum we're in the jungle like this is happening also the shoes just give it like so much more like funness to it probably will take the bag but i can also like if we're going to a like place to eat or something i don't want to wear this and i have to think about like the best way for this because it's like super cowl neck it like fits completely weird like honestly if you were to just wear this and nothing under it like not a bathing suit like i don't know how it would be like whatever but because it's like a bathing suit trying to wear something like really like unique under it like a unique swimsuit so it's like what is going on with her outfit like the sleeves are over here the cow neck is like here the the swim and whatever and then it's super long and it like sticks to your body so it kind of like holds up it's like sheer i don't know i was like should i get rid of it but you know what we're gonna be fun we're gonna be fun in tulum so like let's see maybe we can like layer it something like that i mean it looks very frumpy when you do that so definitely has to be like a thing this is from rat and boa and this is one of their like forever in style thing that they sell it's like one from their original collection um now they have like a lot of other things which i'm probably gonna look to get some more for this trip because i feel like rat and boa the whole thing is just completely tulum honestly this is how i'm probably gonna be like dressing have it like half off because like it falls off i don't know i'll play around with it a little bit but you're coming home with me <laughs> all right i can't make that joke two times in this video okay this thing is also amazing <laughs> this one i'm really excited about because it's like kind of unique in a way that it's from american apparel um when was the last time you shopped in american apparel are they even still open i don't even know but this was gifted to me from my husband's sister she was like oh i never wear this whatever tags on it and look how freaking fun it is so i'm gonna bring this as another option with like the sea of Madden's, obviously doesn't this just give you lindsay lohan in greece like at the party at the bar i feel like it's like so fun i mean it's obviously very see-through but like again wearing the swimsuits i'm gonna try this on with another swimsuit too just to see how it looks but i'm obsessed let me see if I can put on a hat with it. I really should be sticking with the same hats because like, who am I kidding? I'm not gonna bring like four of these hats. Or maybe I will. No, this hat is a possibility. <laughs> um, I don't know. Should I? Should I bring my hat? Like, let's see. It's like, huh, French Riviera with this hat. I love hats because I hate the sun <laughs> on my face. We'll think about it, but this is coming. Um, are you kidding me? Like, I have been searching. I have been searching on websites the word crochet. I should have searched lace. What is this? This is amazing. Like, this screams Tulum. I bought this. Like, ah, uh, this still has the tag on it. This still has the freaking tag on it. I have never worn this. I've wanted to wear this for so long. I mean, maybe I've been waiting to, like, mature. Like, I, honestly, I have no words. There's buttons all down this, so I can, like, button it up. I literally have no words. It's as if I, I have been... <laughs> I have no words. I love to swim i love to go to the beach the pool all these things so i have been holding i have a lot of like swim cover-ups and everything and some things i haven't worn 
and whatever because honestly I just walk around in my bathing suit a lot but um I guess I don't know I have no idea why I've never worn this before but this screams Tulum it's like I've been preparing my whole life to go to Tulum I'm so dramatic watch me like not wear any of this stuff and just walk around in my bathing suit the whole time but like are you kidding me like this is stunning I, I can't even believe I've never worn this ever like the tassels the lace like oh my god so I put it with just like you know this little my little white Hermes sandals and it'll probably just be like this like oh, how freaking cute I can't even I, I'm I've been scouring the internet to find perfect things and I should have just checked my closet. I don't hold on to many things. I am one who loves to like get rid of things if I haven't worn it in a while. So usually that's not what happens for me. I like sell things, get rid of them immediately. I do try to buy things that I will wear all the time and keep for a lot. And as, long, as soon as it no longer suits me, I get rid of it. I have no idea. And I recently went through my bathing suits and cover-ups and got rid of some things. Anyway, guys, I think I'm done. We're done here. We can all go home now. This is freaking it. Like, if this isn't, guys, if this isn't perfect for Tulum, then I literally don't know what is. Let's see what glasses I have going on. Because now I want to accessorize something fun. So these are fun brings out the pink i like these i got them last year at target i did a whole haul video you can catch that on the channel these remind me of glasses my mother had they are way too close together for my eyes and i've never worn them and i will never wear them so they probably they're really cute and they probably will be really cute on someone but not me so i'm gonna sell these look out on poshmark for those these are coming another amazing cover-up that i've probably only worn once in my life maybe it's so good so it's obviously you know very sheer and I have on a blue bathing suit underneath, which is also extremely stunning. I got it from Revolve last year. I don't remember the brand. I'll tag everything, but like this is just very, very perfect fitting. I wonder if I have anything fun, like heel wise. I was thinking like flats, but like, I don't know, it'd be nice to wear like some fun heels but I don't think that works oh I know what heels would be really cute with this uh, I was such on the fence about them but they were they're like this blue color or like between this blue color um, and they're really cute Ooh, should I do it should I do it oh I might do it I love these kind of shirts I got this from Target also it's just kind of like a flowy top so I think like if it gets I think if it gets like cold or something you can just like do something like this you know but like guys chef's kiss this dress with the shirt 